Visitors aren't the only ones impacted by rain. The remnants of Hurricane Simon rolled into New Mexico yesterday, and rain in the forecast has pilots a bit worried. Here's First Alert meteorologist Eric Green to tell us how rain can damage balloons. Tropical moisture moving into New Mexico is not something balloon pilots want to see for the week of balloon fiesta. Water can be hard on some very expensive parts of the balloon, like the envelope. The balloon's not going to last as long if it gets wet. That fabric has a coating on the inside of it. If that coating gets wet, it starts to deteriorate. The one thing pilots don't like is rain coming down overhead. If the showers have ended and the ground is still damp, which we see frequently at Balloon Fiesta Park, the pilots can still stretch out their envelopes, inflate the balloon, and then dry them out with the burners. If you get it a little wet and you're able to get it out and fly it and dry it off, that's fine, but you don't want to be packing it up wet. The gondola is a different story. The wicker basket that pilots and passengers ride in doesn't mind being wet. That wicker basket loves the moisture. Uh, the more moisture I can keep on the wicker, the better. Thursday morning brought a short window of perfect flying conditions, and even though many envelopes probably did get wet laying them out to inflate, the long and quiet flights with a boxing effect gave them all a good chance to dry out. I'm First Alert Meteorologist Eric Green, KOAT Action 7 News. Enjoy.